Home security cameras provide peace of mind when you want to keep an eye on things from afar, or even from the other room. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to install an indoor security camera, how to use it to view your saved video clips, and how to set up a motion detection zone. The $20 Wise Cam is the cheapest security camera I've ever tested, and it also happens to be one of my favorites. That's true for a lot of reasons, but it's mainly because of its solid performance, free cloud storage, and motion zones, and its ridiculously simple setup. I'm going to use the Wise Cam in this video so you can see just how easy it is to install a home security camera yourself. It should take about five minutes, so let's see how close I get. Start the timer. First, connect the included power adapter to the Wise Camera and plug it into an outlet. Next, download the Wise app and make an account. If you already have one, log in with your existing info. Tap New Device on the app home screen to start the setup and then select Wise Cam from the product list. Press the Setup button on the bottom of the camera and wait for the camera to say Ready to Connect. Ready to connect. Now it's time to enter your Wi Fi info to connect to your local network. You'll see a QR code pop up on the app screen. Hold the QR code in front of the camera until it says QR code scanned, please wait. Then click on to the next step and you'll see a timer counting down while the camera tries to connect. It should connect within the first 10 to 30 seconds. Lastly, the app will prompt you to give your WISE camera a name. I'm going with living room, but you can choose anything that helps you differentiate it from other smart devices in your home. As an optional step, you can share access to the camera with friends and family members, but you can also set that up later on. And that's it. Your camera is set up and online and ready to record everything happening within its field of view. Now that your Wise Cam is installed, let's see how to view saved clips. Sometimes that's a default setting in the app, but it's best to check ahead of time so you aren't stuck wondering why your camera isn't working. So first, click on your camera, then hit the settings wheel in the top right corner, and then event recording. This is where you can customize a specific schedule for your camera recordings, or simply enable detects motion or detects sound based on what events you want your camera to capture. I'm only interested in detects motion, so we're good to go. To actually view saved clips, select events on the bottom of the home screen and either scroll through all of your saved clips or filter it by device if you have multiple cameras. The Wise Cam has two weeks of free cloud storage, which is significantly more than most home security cameras offer. Now let's create a motion detection zone. This makes it possible to customize the area where you want motion to be detected, like your entryway to see when your kids get home from school and ignore the busy stairs leading to your basement. Again, click on your camera and hit settings, then detection settings. Click on detection zone and draw a box around the area where you want motion to be detected. And that's it. Now your camera will save video clips when it detects motion, but it will only detect motion in a specific area to avoid extra alerts and save video clips you don't really want.